Giles, man. Why has he just stood there? Giles is getting battered. Oh god, he's literally getting battered. Well, it's your own fault. You did just stand there and waited for them. Why did he just stand there and let them spawn? Foolish man. Welcome back to Rewind Wednesdays, where we play a game from my childhood every Wednesday. Today we are back at it again with Buffy the Vampire Slayer Chaos Bleeds. We're on episode four now. If you've not seen the previous three episodes, then make sure to go watch them. I will leave a link around the video somewhere and also in the description box below. But yeah, let's just get straight into it. So we're back at the magic box. We were there in episode one. We're reconvening here now with Giles. Spike was going to hit some of the vampire hangouts, see if he could get a line on Kakistos. And then there I hope was we get Sid. to fight Kakistos. I literally want to burn him. The dummy? That was a bit dark. <laughs> remember? How could you forget? Looks like Kakistos isn't the only dead guy up and walking around. And Kakistos was being all cryptic. No pun intended. But he banter, kept making comments banter. that make me think it's there's more going on here. It's so 90s. I've I can't a few bothers. theories, but they require more research. Sid seemed to know something about it. I'm so glad that Anthony Head did the too. voice for Giles. I, just, that I don't understand it. why the whole cast didn't yeah, do it. It makes me sad. Did. So you said you had theories? Let's hear them. <laughs> Giles just doesn't want to tell you that his big theory, actually, my theory. Well, I'm sure you haven't forgotten the visit we had from Willow's I'm vampiric Anya. doctor. Her voice actor's good. She sounds just like her. That though. wonderful brush with alternate dimensions to Anya. Yay, me! <laughs> you know. If I hadn't brought evil skanky vampire Willow into this dimension by accident, we would all be completely lost in this conversation right now. So, what then? We're dealing with alternate dimension Kakistos? Oh, yeah. Our research suddenly turned out like, plenty he's definitely dead, but okay. dimensional bleed. Tara got fluffed. Absolutely fluffed up. Sorry, Tara. Tara, are you alright? What's happened? The old factory? Morphed into a big old vampire blood factory, human cattle, all kinds of fun stuff. And in the middle of it all, Ethan Rain and a bunch of Baki Mona. Ethan Rain? Ethan? What does that oily little snake have to do with this? Oh, wrecked. I got the impression he had nothing to do with the factory changing. As for Ethan himself, I, I got the feeling he was testing me, but I don't have the first clue why. Maybe it's an alternate reality version of Ethan. This would have made like cool Tara episode, to a I think. Yes, I think that's wise. There's nothing more to be done this evening. I think we could all do with some rest at this point. Oh, rip. I hope this is actually a level and, and not we'll just like a, search for Ethan. a little See cinematic because that's going to be all good. Pieces together. Agreed. I just need to fill one last mail order. You go ahead. I'll wait and walk you home. Oh, I don't cute. think any of us should be alone right now. I agree, Buffy. That's a, that's a very good plan. All right. I'll you shut the door. I'm not going anywhere. Bitch, I'm a ghost. As soon as the door shuts. Okay, khaki stuff. I'm literally about to Hello wreck these guys so hard. I can't wait till it gets fired. Just a quick visit to my curiosity. I've been wondering to see how well you would function without your watcher. They're gonna kill Giles. No. That is not happening. I will not allow it. What are you talking about, Hoof Boy? Giles? Hoof Boy, Sam. <laughs> yes. And he isn't alone. That's really mean. Look at this guy here. He just didn't move in, so I'm fat mood. Just gonna stand there and I'll say no. You are not gonna get Giles. I don't have any snakes. Oh dear. Just one sec, lads. I just need to find some snakes. Whoa, excuse me. I remember. There's a big bunch over here. Right, come on then. Oh god, this guy might actually kill me. I don't think so. I wasn't even armed and I still kicked your asses, so it says a lot about you. Right, what's the plan here? I need to get down to old G Dog. It's late. I'm tired and I don't want to play games. 
Did she just say it's late, I'm tired and I don't want to fight demons? Fat mood. Constant mood. Right, I need to go get to G-Dog. Big G. I'm go oh god, excuse me. I need to go and get Giles. Alright, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. I don't want Giles to die, I love him. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Excuse me. Just need to go get... Oh. Oh, okay. Thanks, bro. That was real helpful. I was like, oh no, I can't get to him. But he opened it, what a silly. And for my next... Charisma would open doors. So how am I meant to get him then? Not this one. Have I come all the way down here for no reason? Is no one gonna open it for me? So how am I gonna get to Giles then? I'm panicking. What if I've left it too long and he's literally just straight dead and I just failed the whole game? Wait, where am I meant to go upstairs then? Pretty cute. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I killed you, okay. Bye bye. Oh! I'm coming, Giles. Don't you want it? He just set his friend on fire. That's really unfortunate. Uh, can I go out of here? That were locked last. Oh, okay. 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 I don't know how this is going to get me down to the basement though. Look at these lot just waiting for me. Oh god, that was pretty slick. That little uh, helicopter move she just did there. That'll work. Uh, it's a good job that the door wall locked then. I'd have just gone in to like fight him. Giles. Giles there is like. You okay? All Did they ruffle your tweet? We are familiar. We went through the way. But I'll survive. Thanks to the security cage. Remember when I said you were paranoid for wanting to lock away the priceless occult goodies? I meant it. But here's a big yay for your paranoia. I nearly didn't make it into the cage in time. It took some powerful magic to bring those gargoyles to life. So now what? Cause, cause case lost These stone ugly seem pretty unkillable. The, the gargoyles aren't like demons or vampires. Certain magics are required to revert them to their natural state. I, I don't know that. Am I going to get to cast a spell? The store and retrieve my copy of Where's Willow when you need her? She literally just Gordon bounced as well. She could have helped there. us if we were. Uh... She'll be able to figure it out. If she hadn't Great. left. It would have been much too easy if- Oh, I just skipped it, sorry. I was hoping she was just gonna make a sassy comment. Buffy, wait! You can't fight the gargoyles until we learn how to defeat them. Is that a definite no then? What if I just throw a fire at them? Or is that gonna set me on fire? Oh, yeah, okay, it's gonna set me on fire. That's a rookie mistake. What are we getting then? Some spell book. That's right, Giles, you just sit there. I'll do autograph, don't worry. I will do all the work. I spy with my little eye. Right, I have a shovel, and you're all gonna lose. So I suggest you just back off, so I can go get my spell book and become a little witchy witch. I didn't listen to where he said it was. Is it back here again? Like where will those was? No. Oh no! I didn't listen. Is that it? Maybe up on the book cabinet. Oh, okay. <sighs> I should. I need to start listening. It's really bad. Right, Giles, tell me what to do, bro, bro. I want to become a little wicker. Here you go, Giles. One copy of Bilbo's Compendium of Gore Things and Stone Witch Macaulets. Thank you, Buffy. She thinks she's so sassy. No, she's just. See. Um. Ah, gargoyles are susceptible to gorgon venom. A steak dipped in the venom should be sufficient to dispatch them. 
There are some in the shop that make absolutely sure you. There is literally the right like these little the spells dotted about all over the shop. So I noticed that when I was watching the little cinematic. Uh, all I know okay, about the gun convenient. is that it reacts strongly Very to convenient. anything of gargoyle origin. Maybe you'll find something in the shop to help you. Oh, okay, I'm gone. Was that that little demon chest hand that I just went and got earlier that I found downstairs? <laughs> Look at, did that say Gorgon Claw? Okay, yeah, I think that's downstairs. Hopefully there won't be any more vampires down there because I killed them all. <gasps> I need to go get a Gorgon hand. Thank you, sir. I wish this big one had just died, well they're both pretty big to be fair. And now there's someone third party and I'm not in the mood. Oh my god, so many. Excuse me, I don't want to fight you, I'm sorry, I, don't, I can't bother. No, I'm literally just going to weave in and out of them. I'll fight them all on the way back. Oh god, they just broke my shovel. Oh no, they made me drop it. Oh, at least I can pick it up for the door though. Oh god, no, I think I made a rook here, boys. Because now they're all in here. Oh god, this is, this is a mistake. Oh look how low my health is. Oh god, oh god, I might need a med pack here. Okay, we got it, we got it, we got it, we got it. This was, that, that's my own stupid fault for just trying to like, run past them all. Okay. Let's start paying attention. I need to start listening to what people are saying. And I need to just kill the enemies that are there because if not, I'm going to be in a real bad situation. Oh my god, it was. Love that. So now I need to locate... Was it... Did they say gag or venom? Is that what I need to get? And then dip my stakes in it. Make a little lethal weapon. Imagine we get there and Giles is wrong and it doesn't work at all. Oh god, there's three of these big guys here. I'm literally not in the mood. Oh my god, just die. I keep staking him too early, right? Where was this little alright, there's one there. No reaction with the gargoyle claw. This can't be Gorgon Venom. No reaction with the gargoyle claw. This can't be Gorgon Venom. If it's that gr it's literally this green one, isn't it? Of course it's green. Of course. This can't be Classic. I should have just gone straight for that one. Rookie mistake. <clears throat> Time to kick some gargoyle ass. Let's go kick some gargoyle ass. I hope Giles helps. I bet he won't though. I bet he'll just sit there. Buffy, you have the stakes. Excellent. Destroy the gargoyles. Yeah, literally look, he's just like, go do it. You go do it. I'll just sit here. I'll just chill. Cedar Rapids. Whoa. God, they've actually got better health, okay. Alright, that's one. Oh my god, they're not even that hard. I bet I could have killed them without the gag, goyle, venom, or whatever it was. Bye bye. Excellent. Right, get yourself up, J-Dog. You're not really doing much, are you? You just sat there feeling sorry for yourself. Oh my god. I don't think I can be bothered waiting for him when he's like hobbling about. Am I gonna have to protect him? What do we have here? Protect and attack. Oh, there's not any enemies. Maybe I've killed them all already. Come on, Giles, man! Oh my god, he's literally taking forever. Yeah, it's alright, Giles got all day. Oh you know there is enemies again. Okay. Come on. No, 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 no. Hey, listen, I've got to go. No, no, you stay right here. Bye bye. How you doing, J Dog? Not very well. It's taking forever, but okay. I'd get very mad with him on the street if I was walking behind him, I'm not gonna lie. What could he have possibly done to his leg that is making him walk that badly? Oh my god, Giles, man. Why is he just stood there? <gasps> oh, okay, so we literally have to wait for the enemies. Giles is getting battered. Oh god, he's literally getting battered. 
Well, it's your own fault. You did just stand there and waited for them. Oh my god, Giles is not in a good way. I better not. No, 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 no. I better not have done all this for him to die. Die, bro. Oh my god. Right, I'm holding my spike. Why did he just stand there and let them spawn? Foolish man. Right, come on, bro. Okay, there's two more. We got this. We got this. Oh my god, just die, please. Please. No, 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 Why do they go straight for him and not for me? I'm the slayer. What do you want with a little librarian? Little magic shop owner? Right, Giles, get your shit together, please. We need to go. Is that a crossbow? Cool. Oh. I've been saving up for one of these. I mean, I don't like the crossbow, to be fair, but cool that it's there. Right, come on, Giles. You got this. How is he going to get up the stairs? Oh. I'm going to help him because he can't do much. <laughs> Jesus, what even happened to him to him to physically not be able to walk properly? Character. Faith? Hey, B. I love Faith so much. And she did What's the voice. Shaking? Love your Eliza Rushke. What, what that. legend. Last time I saw you, you tried to take over my life. Went all body snatchers on me. Then there was the LA Rampage. Now you break out of prison and I'm supposed to say, what? Welcome home? I was thinking more along the lines of pull up a chair, grab a beer. But yeah, basically. We don't got a hug or nothing. Say what you want. I'm still a slayer. Bad as you might want to, you can't take that away. And the jailbreak? You just, I just love need Faith a breath so of fresh air? She's literally well, like, no, I think my favourite character. Sucks. Shine a light on that revelation. But between fighting off it the Butch so sisters like and trying not to rise so to the guard's the bait, oh, I'm getting my head straight. No. Not loving it there, but it wasn't my idea to leave just now. Okay, so if the jailbreak wasn't just because you missed the stellar Sunnydale nightlife, what the hell are you doing here? Long story, Chica, but I got the answer man right here. Hello, Slayer. Oh, for... F forget it. She Look, was gonna say I'm I need to get Giles then. to the hospital. When you're done well and I'm witch boy here, they can patch him up. Doctors now, answers later. God save Giles. Oh, 11 minutes. That was like the quickest episode ever. 40 monsters killed though. I'm so sorry that was such a short episode, but I am going to leave it there. There will be another episode of Buffy next Wednesday. Probably going to simp over Faith for a few hours. Maybe take Giles to the hospital, beat up Ethan Rain. Who knows? The possibilities are endless. But make sure you come back to find out what happens next. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe below and hit the little notification bell so you know when I upload. And I'll be back again next week for another Rewind Wednesday. Bye, guys.